That's his head right there, and his tail is right there. Crazy, he is a crazy guy, dude. If it bites you, it will not let go, and you will bleed. Get in the tank. Oh, oh yes, whoa. that thing is sick. What is going on, Barbs? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new here, my name is Jack. We have ponds, we have tanks, and there's a whole lot coming on this channel, so make sure you guys go down, subscribe, and turn on your post notification bell. In today's video, we walked into Barrier Reef, and we saw an eel that we've been waiting for for a very long time. We thought we were gonna go ahead and send it on a snowflake eel, but everyone has those and we, th we thought we wanted to be different. So we saw this Tesselata Mora eel. It is the coolest eel we've ever seen. It's like a zebra. Wait till you guys see it. Now let's go check it out. All right, you guys, we just walked up to Barrier Reef and they just got a shipment and they got this sick eel. It looks like a zebra. It's called a Tesselata eel. Right there, he's about a foot long. That's his head. Let me zoom in on his head. That's his head right there and his tail is right there. So. He's probably about a foot. This camera is going to die, so we're just gonna bag this thing up right now, head home, put this thing in the tank, and it's gonna look sick. Oh my god, that is sick! That thing is awesome. It's our first eel. Sending it home right now, let's get this thing acclimated. All right guys, we got the eel. Liam is tweaking about getting something else. He's probably gonna get another fish within the week, but that is a, this is gonna be our first eel that we've ever had going in this tank. We've, I've never had owned an eel, but I, Robin said, the guy who works here, super hardy, they eat a lot of meaty fish. They eat a lot, they're super easy to care, take care of, you know, tilapia or, or a little damsel or whatever, and we actually have two damsels in there, let's see if he eats them, but um, I'm excited. We're gonna be stoked, let's go back home acclimate this thing and you guys will get a really good look at him because he is he's gonna be I'm just hyped let's get back to the crib sweet now's the time let's god I can't wait to see him in the tank let's do it all right guys we made it back to the house see that bag right behind me you guys are gonna get an amazing look at this thing this thing is I have always wanted one of these things. I swear, it's like I get we get in the coolest thing every time we post a video. If you're not subscribed, what are you doing? All we do is send on the coolest, coolest fish, okay? The coolest fish. So come over here and you guys are gonna get a really good look at this thing. Look how crazy this thing is. Wow. That is a Tesselata eel. It has a huge dorsal fin running across his whole back of his body. I don't know if you can really tell. But that's a total, that's like a flappy thing. It's a fin, pretty much, going down his whole body. He is super active, he's been jumping up here. I don't know if he's gonna do it again, but he comes out of the water, literally. Like, he'll do it right now. Oh no, he was just about to do it. Right there, right there. He just, see him, see him, he gets out of the water like that, he's crazy. He is a crazy guy, dude. I'm telling you, thank God we got these lids on our tank because this thing would jump right out of this tank in a split second, so. We're letting him acclimate, and then we're gonna put him in, and we have two damsels in here already. I have to hate, hate to bring it to you guys, but uh, goodbye damsels. It's just, uh, this thing is a fierce, fierce predator, and it's going to eat everything that can, uh, it can fit in its mouth. Like, it literally can. So, he's got a little hint of yellow to him. I can, I can see that right now. He's got like a tiny hint of yellow, but he's mostly black and white. And if, you look, if you look tiny, he's like a little, can't really see right here. You'll probably see it when he's actually in the tank. It'll be like with the white sand on him. And um, so we're gonna give him like a good 25 minutes, dump some water in the bag, get him really acclimated, and uh, we're gonna let him in this thing. And he's gonna live and thrive. So give us a little bit, and we'll see you when we put him in the tank. Actually, as we're waiting, you know, it's always good to feed our flower horn. He loves to eat. Like he literally tweaks every time I come to this tank. He's like. Literally, a psycho. Come over here, buddy. Come over here. Right there. Crushes him, dude. I dropped one. Over here. Crushed it. Crushed it. This guy does not stop eating. Love that fish. Love this fish. Anyways, back to the eel. It has been 20 minutes, and look how amazing this fish is. It's a zebra. We've been waiting for an eel like this for so long. We were looking at the snowflake eel, the chain link. Even a more eel we even thought about, but this eel is the one we've been waiting for. We walked in a bear and they had him. Look how cool it is. It's about a foot long. It's got this huge tank to live in and he's gonna get some friends very soon. Actually, he's gonna get one today that you guys will see in another video, but let's unbag this thing, put him in the tank and see what he does. 
We are scared of Bao doing this right now because the guy at the store said if it bites you, it will not let go and you will bleed. This eel is from the Red Sea and they only get two a year. That's what he said. He said they're super rare. They get over five feet long. The barrier reef where we shop, they had one of these for five years or maybe more, 10 years, 20 years. I don't know. And it was five feet long and they had to have some guy come and get it out of there with a huge net. So that might be our case one day. So let's get this guy out. Oh man, it's a snug fit. Here he goes. We're, we're all scared. Okay, this thing can easily decapitate me. Ready? Yes. Oh my god. Just get it out as quick as possible, dude. Oh shit. <laughs> it did, it did. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, get in the tank. Oh, oh yes. Whoa. That thing is sick. That thing is sick. Oh, he's going to find his little cave and he's going to go find a damsel to go eat right oh now. My god. Oh my god. He is. That's it. We'll never see him again. We'll never see him again. Are you serious? And there's our eel. He is gone in the rocks. And he'll, you'll probably never see him again. Oh, he's right there. He's coming out. Is he going to be pissed at the damsel? Hey, look at it. There's our damsel, by the way. Look, here he is. There he is. Whoa, he's gone. Oh, there he is. Dude, he's so awesome. He's oh, just figuring out the tank right now. That's all he's doing. He's just figuring out the tank. He's going to wax that damsel tonight. And that's sick. Look at him! Look how sick he is! He's through the cave! Dude, is this his spot? This he's just spot. figuring it out. Look at that fish, guys. He's coming right up. He's coming right up. He's got a cool little dorsal fin that goes all the way down his back. That's a zebra. I think we name him Big Vinny. What about you guys? Oh my god, he's all the way up there. He he's is he is, he is really, really good. I think we load it straight with eels. Let's all eels? All eels. Wow. Eels. Shout out Liam. Eels. What's up? Yeah. Shout out Jeff. Yeah. Liam's dad. Good guy. <laughs> he's really Figuring everything out, and he he's gonna eat that damsel for sure. Look at, that, look at that damsel right there. That thing is probably so scared. Yeah, he's like he's like, what is this thing? All right, guys, quick montage of this thing so you guys can really really enjoy him. Well, if you guys did notice, we got a new tank light on this thing, or actually the, our first tank light on this, and uh, it's sick. I'm going to walk you guys through it now. It's called a loop light. It's got so many settings. Just look at the controller. Just a little taste of what's to come. So, bro, cue the lights. Here we go. This is what it is like all the way on. Just look how pretty it looks, and it's a little bit of a strobage, but we're looking good. So, that is it all the way on. That is called full sun. This is... Sunset right here That is called sunset Right there that is beautiful Sunset now we got moon Look at that Moon Nice and dark nice and dark purplish. It's very nice So now we're gonna now we're gonna roll with some of the cooler stuff now. We're going rolling clouds everyone rolling clouds Ready? Look at that. Oh man, it's probably cloudy out over there. Yeah, a little bit more sun heading east. There we go. Look at that. The cloud is just rolling. Look at that. Look at this. Watch. Rolling clouds. There's the cloud. She's rolling. She's going. That's Look at that. Cloud I've ever seen. That thing is rolling. There you go. Now we're going thunderstorm. Ready? Oh! Shop. Some lightning. Shop. Get inside now. Oh my god. Yeah. Lightning, Chris. Get inside. Oh! God, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look you at know, all this lightning. That's a lightning. Jeez. All right, guys. That is our light. If you guys are interested in this light, it is called a loop light. LED 72 inch something else. But if you look that up, you guys will be able to find it. But uh, yeah, really cool light. Really cool eel. And where's his head? Well, there he is. Sweet. All right, guys, that is going to be it for the video. Before you leave, drop a like if you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment. What do you guys want to name that brand new eel? He's sick. Think of something good. Whatever gets the most likes, that's what we're going to name it. So if you guys see a comment that you like the name, drop a like on it, and uh, we'll pick that probably on Thursday. So make sure you guys are subscribed with your post notification bell on because we're going to be putting a lot of fish in that tank very soon. You're not going to want to miss what we're putting in there. Some very crazy, colorful fish, groupers, Stingray, 
just just be ready. Turn on your post notification bell so you guys do not miss that. Also, I know you guys really like the giveaways, so we're gonna be giving away a Google Home. Right here, Google Home Mini. This is gonna be our New Year's giveaway. We're gonna be announcing this giveaway winner on January 20th. That is a Sunday, January 20th. We're gonna be announcing this winner. All you guys need to do to enter this giveaway, you need to subscribe with your post notification bell on. That's number one. Number two, you need to leave a like on this video and all our videos to come, leave a like. And for a double entry, go follow us on Instagram, at barbsbuzzin, and you might have a chance to win this right here. How easy could it be? Just, just subscribe, turn on the notification bell, drop a like, double entry, follow us on Bars Buzz. Might be winning a Google Home Mini right there. So that is it for today's video. We'll be seeing you guys tomorrow. Peace. <laughs> Shout out Big Mini for this deal. Oh my God, it's right here, right now. Jesus Christ. Liam, be ready. Do not drop that net. Hey, uh, do the thing. Oh, wait, I I got it. This is what it is like. All the way on. Okay. That's how I wake up every This is, yeah, this is the tank light all the way on. Perfect <laughs> light. Oh, okay, I got it.